This is Dabu7. We now have a senior North Korean official saying that the U.S. is creating a dangerous situation, one in which he says a thermonuclear war could break out at any minute. Now, North Korea's deputy United Nations ambassador added that the Korean Peninsula is the world's biggest hotspot due to the military activity from the U.S. More on the way with the threats and the tension. He says North Korea is ready to react at any mode of war that is desired by the United States. Kim additionally derided that the U.S.-South Korean missile exercises being conducted off the coast are like the largest ever aggressive war drill, and it's adding to the tensions. So, basically, their most recent statements are that we're just on the tip of getting ready to pop off with war. This comes with Mike Pence going there, dropping his little threats and quotes, then Trump saying that he was going to consider kinetic military action, a sudden strike. Now, I talked about this before in other videos. I've talked about how we now have Russian and Chinese vessels that are tracking the armada that Trump sit in, trying to pick up any bit of information they can off of them. Russian aircraft skirting the coast of Japan. And things really tense here as North Korea also just announced that they're going to continue to conduct these missile tests on a weekly, monthly, yearly basis. Which could mean that here within the week, before or by the time the 25th comes, they could launch another test. The thing is this, if we have U.S. military, allied military out there in the waters and they launch in any of them's direction, they can say that that was a hostile act and it could spark off something big. So, this is some of the latest in what they're saying. I wanted to get it out there and let it be known. I will continue to update on this situation as things change. I'll leave a link below. It's been Dapu7.